BD is one of the largest medical technology companies in the world. BD manufactures billions of medical devices a year, billions, and we ship to 190 different countries. We have to make sure that each of these devices is identified and we understand what that item is. UDI stands for Unique Device Identification, and that's a term the regulators came up with to identify products in a specific way. BD has an incredibly diverse set of customers. Of course, hospitals, but also doctor's offices and nursing homes and laboratory settings and universities and really a broad array throughout healthcare. To make device identification a reality, BD utilizes the GS1 system of standards. They're able to, with a single scan, understand who the device manufacturer is, they can unambiguously identify what product it is, and they can learn certain characteristics about that item. It goes beyond just the scan of identifying the device, you're able to then open up a whole nother world where you're able to learn more about that product and all the characteristics about it. Our earliest use of what we now call GS1 standards goes back to the 1970s. So we picked GS1 and began using their standards long before it was an FDA requirement. I believe that the entire healthcare ecosystem benefits by having the precise identification of medical devices. We put a barcode on that product and it can get scanned within our internal systems and then it, as it leaves our facilities, then distributors and hospitals and others are able to capture that same information and have the exact same understanding of that product that we have. Back before the FDA's UDI regulation was in place, I had hernia surgery. As I went through surgery and come out of the recovery room, I was trying to find out what did you put inside of me? And I could not get an answer. And it just seems that a patient should know when they're getting an implant, what has been put inside of them and that is where the GS1 standards come into play. The end of every device is a patient, right? Someone's using that product, whether it's one of us or a loved one, there's a patient at the end of every single one of those devices. And I think that's the standard we have to have in mind with everything we do. We wanted to have a uniform standard throughout our system and GS1 was the obvious choice.